In this video, I show you how to make video sound your ringtone on your iPhone. Let's do this. The first thing you need to do is go and download some apps for this guide. So firstly, go and open up the app store just like so and go and tap on search. And the first app you're going to need is called Ringtone Maker. So go and type that in just like so and I'll show you the actual app you need. Uh, so the app you need is this one here, Ringtones Maker, the Ring app. So go and download this and the second app you're going to go need is called GarageBand. GarageBand is actually by Apple themselves, um, but so it is a completely free app, so go and download it. There it is. So you can go and tap on download and go and download it. Now, what we need to do is firstly go and open up the Ringtone Maker app. So go and open it up just like so. Then what you need to do is go to the bottom and go and tap on that plus button just like so, and then go and tap on import from video. What this is gonna go and do is it needs access to our photos. So I'm gonna go and allow access, but then it's gonna show your entire camera roll. And what you need to do is go and find the video which you want to go um, and use the sound from to go and create uh, into a ringtone. So I want it to be this one here. So I've now gone and tapped on it just like so. Then find the audio file that you just extracted from the video in the My Ringtone list. And beneath the file, there'll be four options. And the first one should be make, and you need to go and tap on it on the left-hand side. Within a few seconds, you're going to go and get your share menu pop up. And what we need to do is go and open up the file which has just been created in GarageBand. So to tap on GarageBand just like so and it's now going to open up. And your phone will need to rotate because that's how we use GarageBand. Then what you need to do is find the file that was just created using the Ringtone app. As you can see in my case it's this one on the far left. It was created at 12.06 and you can also go and see the date and time. So what you need to do is then hold your finger on this file just like so and then you're going to go and get these options here and what you need to do is go and tap on share. You may need to go and scroll down this list here as you can see it moves. Go and tap on share. Then we've got these three different options here and what you need to do is go and tap on ringtone just like so and as you can see we can now go and export it as a ringtone so I'm going to go and name this uh, video sound or something like that just so I can prove to you that it's correct so type in video sound and then you can go and tap export in the top right and it's going to go and say exporting. Then it'll go and say export successful and I'm going to go and tap OK and now I'll show you how you can go and set this sound as a ringtone. So what you need to do is go and open up your settings just like so and scroll down until you go and see the option with sounds and haptics. Then in here, what you need to do is go and tap on ringtone like this. Then at the top of the ringtones list here, you're going to have a list of the custom ringtones. As you can see, here's one I just created called video sound. So I can now go and tap on video sound like so. And now that's going to be the one which is used when my phone rings. And that's literally it, guys. If you guys found this video useful, please go down below and consider leaving a like. Peace.